be strange if I asked to take your picture. Oh, girl. No. What is wrong with you, bitch? At least you being safe, girl, but is this really a safe situation? Hi guys, welcome back to The Shannon Show. Hello, if you're new, so today's video is going to be a reaction of The Voyeurs. I hope everybody is doing as well as can be and I really do hope everybody is being as proactive as possible in supporting the Black Lives Matter movement and if you're still on the lookout for some resources I've linked some in the description. Feel free to comment down below your thoughts on my commentary. I'm always up for a chat, I'm always up for a debate and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you didn't give it a dislike no hard feelings and if you really really like this video consider subscribing and helping your girl out. So, the Voyeurs, obviously, it's got my girl, Sydney Sweeney, in it from Euphoria. It's also got Justice Smith in it from Generation and Ben Hardy. I know the name, I know the face, but I can't recall seeing him in anything. Um, and it's billed as an erotic thriller. I've seen the trailer, I've read the premise, and on paper, it seems interesting, but the early reviews... I basically said that it's shit and in my experience often erotic themed stuff is shit so i'm interested to see what experience i'm going to have whether i'm going to disagree and find it good whether it's going to be bad but a good type of bad or whether it's going to be torture but even still i feel like even with the torturous ones they're still really fun to edit but i'm interested i'm going to go into it with an open mind but i feel like within the first five minutes you kind of know whether it's going to be a shit show or not but anyway, let's get into it. Right, glasses. Headphones. Let's fucking go. Okay, we're at the an underwear shop. Oh, lingerie. I used to say lingerie with no shame. <laughs> Oh. Ah, the ghetto. Okay, Sydney. In the lingerie. changing rooms yet the curtains don't be stretching all the way where is the privacy this intro is like a tv show rather than a movie feels like i'm signing my life away yeah it kind of does when you sign a rental always read the contract though because these landlords can be dodgy out here Babe, this is our home. I gotta live here with you. Yeah, this is gonna be a shit show. They have no chemistry. How is this meant to be an erotic thing? I don't want some gooey toddler mess up the last few years of being rebellious. I feel that. I want to wake up Sunday morning with hangover that reminds me of all the terrible decisions I made the night before. I'm here for it. Hey, you deserve it. You deserve all the hangovers in the world. This accent is throwing me off. You deserve it. You deserve it. You deserve all these things in the world. <laughs> Who decided? To making wonderful, terrible decisions. Wonderful, terrible decisions. Yes, let's get to the drama because this shit is boring. Oh, that uh, oh. man is taking off her clothes. Uh, Thomas. That is happening. <laughs> Thomas. What? I don't think we should spy on our neighbors. No, we're not spying. We're just looking outside our window and they happen to be in our field of vision. I'm not against living in a high-rise building, but this is one of the things I think about, like, especially in the hotter months, you know, when you just want to let her all hang out. So I feel like this would be one of the most off-putting things. But then again, they do have curtains. They don't really cover much, but they still have curtains and they're not covering. So then comes the dilemma. If you see someone doing the nookie, 
are you gonna watch i think a lot of people would would i i think once it gets to this point then i'd be like okay let me give you their privacy i don't know i personally don't want to see strangers in my window getting it on personally no but let me know let me know if you would be looking and do you think it would be wrong to look let me know because some people are exhibitionists and actually do this on purpose and don't care if anyone sees or actually want people to see and get turned on what are you guys' thoughts afternoon is he about to do what i think he's about to do yep that is some good content <laughs> Okay, Thomas, we are officially being creepy weirdos, don't no, you agree? what? They, they want us to look, but we'll stop because you want me to. Thank you. It's our first night. Right, right. Let's give our new neighbors some privacy. See, the first night, they're going to keep it cute, but then obviously, they're going to be like, hold on a minute, maybe I do want to watch. <laughs> they got that whole that wholesome couple just dancing juxtaposition i see what they did there so i got you a little thomas if <laughs> uh, maybe another day girl No, it ain't gonna work, girl. I'm on day three of a social media blackout. Joni and I pledged to go an entire month. I respect that. I personally couldn't do it. When you see birds drinking from this outside your window, let it be a little reminder of how imperfect our own species vision is. Bird outside the window, bird watching, watching, spying on the neighbor having sex. Clocked it. What are their names? Uh, she's definitely a Margo. Oh yeah, of course. She's clearly a Margo. Yeah, this is definitely a shit show. Well, maybe Brent could also tell me how to sculpt my body here. Caught a glimpse of his pubes yesterday. They were exquisitely manscaped. Would you ever want me to do that? No. Wouldn't they grow back prickly or something? <laughs> prickly. I gotta hear from you guys. To shave or not to shave the men's pubes. Let me know the verdict. Before I had my balls trimmer, I had smelly balls all the time. Oh, she's thirsting over here. This is sticky waters, you got a man. <sighs> Did he catch her though? Probably not, it would have been too dark for him to see. Stopping his work to spy? The investment is that much. Interesting. <laughs> wow, these get so close. I know, right? You're only a hundred bucks. Only? Did you negotiate? No, should I have? Yeah, you probably could have got them for 50. Yeah, always got a haggle shat it. If it's the right environment. Why barking? I'm sorry. Why barking? Please stop. No. You're scaring my son. Look, people will go. You're scaring my son. Look, people are done. Please. Hey, yo. Boobs. Stop. Boobs, babe. There's boobs. No wonder she's getting turned off by this man. Look at the material. What are you doing? Taking your shirt off. Okay, she's trying to spice some things up. Okay, girl. Um, Okay, girl. A little harder. Okay, girl. 
Like that? Yeah. I bet she's imagining him fucking her. Oh. Oh. <sighs> she is not impressed, Shadi. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> Why are you apologizing? <laughs> She's being nice about it. They're still gonna be fucking. <laughs> Girl, this guy is boring in every sense. <laughs> I discovered they figured out how to jerry-rig a laser pointer into a long-range microphone so that we could all low-key listen in on Kylie's private conversations. Mon Dieu. <laughs> you were an accomplice to this? No. Maybe. This is a bit creepy. I have a bad idea. I cannot believe we're doing this right now. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Future us is going to be so impressed. Yeah, well, present tense me is freaking fuck out. This is creepy. Going on here. Okay. What the fuck was all that? Yeah. You still wanna fuck him, sis? I don't know. Maybe the weird dick hits. Girl, I know what you're doing in there. <laughs> Before you go into the bathroom with some woman. Okay, so she's already she already knows he's cheating. Okay, all right, fine. You really want to do it now? Yeah. Tell me the truth. Do you still love me? That's his excuse for cheating. I think I think you you want to leave me, but you, you haven't got the fucking balls to do it. So you come up with all these ridiculous excuses just to try and make it my fault, not yours. The gaslighting. No, no, no. I saw you. You know, I, you know the point. I shouldn't even have to explain myself. You're supposed to trust me. You really think that I would fuck someone in our apartment? Is that what you think? <laughs> Men can lie. Without my work, who's gonna pay for all this? Are you? <laughs> huh? Your income gonna support us? I mean, if you get if we get divorced, then I won't be done in time. Oh, whoa, I... I don't want a divorce. I... I... no. <laughs> yes, marry rich, but make sure you have your own money so you're not putting up with this bullshit, Shadi. And if you are, make sure you're gathering the funds so you could make a swift exit, shout it. If you're sorry, you change. I will. I will. Will you? I don't want to with you. Yeah. Huh? Will you? Will you change? Yes. You will? Yes. Okay, this is... This is very abusive. Okay, so did I fuck someone tonight? No. No? no. Did, did, was someone sucking my cock? No. Uh. No. No, they weren't. Do you still love me? Yes. Then stop acting like such a fucking cock! <laughs> oh girl to live in a nice apartment it ain't that deep sweetie you can find another rich man daddy one that's nicer mm -hmm. and that's why you should mind your business but they're not gonna stop are they you okay Yes, I think I'm coming down with something. Coming down with not minding your business. Hey, Pipsqueak, can you come here for a sec? Ooh. Oh, because he broke her glasses. Thank you. Um, I'm Julia. Her name is Julia. You have terrible vision. I hate eye exams. I'm going to look at the surface of your eye to see if there's any imperfections. Ooh, maybe he bruised her eye socket. Are they trying to sexualize this eye exam? Look up. Left. This is a bit weird. A cup of coffee sometime or something? Is that weird? No. Are you sure? No, I'd, I'd love that. 
I mean, I know we just met, but you seem cool. Thank you. Well, uh, can I have your number? This never happens in real life. You just get your eye exam and go. You usually charge. Oh yeah, usually it's an extra 200 bucks to you. I can't get paid, but I'm waiting for you. Well, I appreciate that. Look, come on, what's the issue? Come on, yeah, bro. I'm not gonna. So he's a creepy ass photographer as well. This can't actually work. Oh. <sighs> oh, sis, did you need $200 that bad, girl? Because if it's like that, girl, you could have got a higher price somewhere else, Shadi. <laughs> Hopefully she got hers from the material. It really don't be looking that great, to be honest. <laughs> I think that she just needs a friend. Someone to talk to about her super unhealthy relationship. Oh, now you realize. He screwed someone while she was with me? Technically oral, but it was not cool, so. I don't know, I was thinking, and I think maybe this isn't good for us. Yeah, I agree, it felt weird not telling her. Well, she's gonna snitch. Yeah, but it, it feels weird to be spying on our neighbors, right? Sneaking around, keeping our lights off so they don't see us. You're not really seeing her this weekend, are you? If I was cheating on you, wouldn't you wanna know? It's funny how she's trying to play hero like she wasn't getting turned on by them fucking like a weirdo. Am I not enough for you? How did he make it about him? She doesn't even be saved by you. This is straight up none of your business. That is true, to be fair. Thomas. It feels like guilt to me, girl. Just, just relax, will you? I, I am, I am relaxed. Not relaxed. I am. Oh no, it's her. It's like when you're so obsessed with something that you forget to pick your head up and look around and go, oh wait, what am I even doing? That you're too far down the rabbit hole. Yeah, bitch. I think you forgot. I have like 8,000 interests and zero skills. I kind of feel that, except I do have qualifications and skills. Talented and gifted. I didn't go to college. I can barely type. I just bought this wireless printer and it took me literally forever to figure out how it works. On the plus side, you don't have any student loans. <laughs> On minus side, I don't have a career. <laughs> she could be an influencer. Okay, they just met and they're already getting naked together. Okay. She has huge boobs. Sad. He loves me. Sounds like a catch. Oh, and he's like incredible in bed, so. I think the whole town knows, girl. Tuesday and Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Without him, I don't know what I'd do with my life. He's all I've got. That's sad, girl. We should meet him sometime. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, girl, you should say. <laughs> girl, this should have been your first and last meeting. You ain't even snitch. I haven't even watched it to know they're going to meet up again and she's going to meet the husband. But I know it's going to happen. <laughs> it doesn't even hide shit properly, oh my god. Yeah, you are a mess. Oh, now she's working the sound system. What is she doing? Girl, this is getting creepier and creepier. Is this how she's gonna snitch? Oh. <laughs> this is how she's 
going to tell him about the condom in the bin. <laughs> Pippa, what did you do? <laughs> yeah, be quiet, bitch. Ew, she's holding it. Look at her. Look at her. I know you think this is wrong. It is wrong. I couldn't just sit back and watch. You didn't need to watch. Mm -hmm. We Pippa. both decided to peer in on them. We both did that, so it's not my fault that we discovered this. No, oh, girl. Hey, what is she doing? It was your idea in the first place. Pippa, give me those. Really, girl? Take some responsibility. <laughs> ah! She couldn't do it. Not everybody can. She's not a killer. No oh, birds finally come. What does this mean now? We've got an hour left. You have every right in the world to be mad at me. He does. I am. Mm-hmm. I'm I'm disappointed. Mm-hmm. Tell it how it is. I wanna know that I can trust you. You can't. You can. Mm-mm. I want to feel like I'm enough for you. You are. Clearly not. Sorry. Okay. What should I disappoint you? Can I get a hug? He's lost the mumble accent. What are you doing? No, 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 no. No. Ah, uh, I have to go. This is why you mind your business. Wait, what? I can't be here. Where are you going? I don't know. Yo, stay with my sisters. I just can't be here. Thomas, you can't go. Yeah, bitch. Please, you can't. I need you right now. No, no, I can't. I can't be with you. I don't blame you. Thomas, wait. I told you we needed to stop, but no, you were goddamn sense of self righteousness. I had to go and do that. Thomas, I'm really scared, and I need you. Please don't go. I... Oh, girl. I love you. If you loved me, you would have listened to me. How was I supposed to know what was going to happen? Like, what am I supposed to do? There's nothing you can't do, Pippa. She's dead. Mm -hmm. Because of you. You ended that fucking woman's life. You did that. I mean, I wouldn't say it was her fault, but she definitely instigated. I wouldn't say it was her fault, but she definitely instigated. She had it. And is she actually dead? Like, I'm so sorry. I didn't know. If I would have known, I would have never done that. I'm so sorry. I don't know why. I don't know why that would happen. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Now he's gonna hear that. Girl, you're so fucking stupid. Okay. Oh my god. Girl, what is you doing? Hmm. Do I know you? I, I, I don't think you do. You've got a familiar face. Pretty eyes. Thanks. Okay, that was worse. Don't know what the artistic thing was meant to be. Do you watch pornography? Um, <laughs> excuse me? Girl, girl, just leave. Most people watch porn all the time. Pets, everyone. Everyone watches porn. Pets, what type of porn you into, Shadi? Did this simple act change the love you had for him? No. It didn't. I don't know because it's meaningless. Exactly. She trying to justify who she is. A vibrator isn't connected to a brain. I would argue that most penises aren't connected to a brain. A vibrator isn't connected to a soul. I've had plenty of sex that was just as meaningless, if not more meaningless, than masturbation. The only difference is it's just more fun having sex with a person than it is with your hand. <laughs> Speak for yourself because you're really speaking. Not everyone agrees with you. 
No. I don't. No matter how much you fucking love me. Oh, girl. I'm going through the most difficult separation in my life right now, and um, I know I can be a bit blunt, I'm sorry. She said separation, so is she not dead? Oh, we've got some Christine in the back, okay. Who finds discontentment in one place is unlikely to find happiness in another. Donkey was a slave, though. This is a really bad <laughs> analogy. He was just always gonna have a shit life. He wrote it for his slaves. So when they're feeling down, they could tell each other that story and make themselves feel better. When in reality, they were just deeply, deeply repressed. Brainless penis has a point. Would it be strange if I asked to take your picture? Oh, girl. No. What is wrong with you, bitch? Watch out for broken glass. I had a little accident. I'm disappointed. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Just do whatever I tell you to do and it'll be perfect. Oh, girl. Is it okay? It's just this, this jumper. Oh, girl. It's out of the ordinary. But if you're not comfortable, it's cool. No, it's, it's, it's fine. Um... Like, I don't know what is going on here. Does she want to fuck him? Like, what's going on, sis? Mind if I snap a few? And then what if poor Julia is alive and she comes back and sees your ass in the collection? I'll make it less awkward. And he takes off his shirt. What are you doing? What does it look like? It's not the same thing. Your chest does not look as good as hers, Charlie. You tried it. Nice socks. Thanks. <laughs> oh, and the trousers are off. He didn't even ask you to take off your underwear. And now his is off. Pippa, what are you doing? I feel like Pippa just wanted to fuck him this whole time because I don't know what this plan is. Okay, she's going topless. Sydney, okay. Sydney, I hope the check was good. I knew she just wanted to fuck him. Pippa, you are a mess. Oh, so, so, so stop. Go, go get a gun. Pippa! And is she being safe, girl? But is this really a safe situation? Not even just physically, but mentally, like the next day, like you just fuck this monster, like, girl. Imagine if her mom was at home spying <laughs> and saw it through the window. Tiffa, you are very fraudulent. Oh. He even bought her flowers. She did not deserve them flowers. Am I, is my eyes seeing what I think I'm seeing? <laughs> Sorry about it, so this. <laughs> she really meant it when she chose to that bad decisions. <laughs> the door's open. He must have packed all of his shit up and left. <gasps> what? <laughs> no, why 
how did he do that? <laughs> I'm sorry. That was really dramatic. I mean, yeah, it wasn't nice to see, but really? You loved her that much? After she played you like that? How did this film get commissioned? You know, it could have been an entertaining bad watch until that point, because now it's just like, what the fuck? What the fuck? She's gonna go to the exhibition and see herself. Yes, it is tragic. It's more than tragic, it is fucking insane, but you had no idea that this would happen. I mean, you were just dumped. Yeah, maybe you deserved it, that part doesn't matter. You are a single woman. She is a good friend. It just, it doesn't feel real. Hey, you are so super fucked up right now. And you better seek therapy like tomorrow. Yeah, she needs to because <laughs> what is she fucking doing? You're a good person, Pippa. Even if it doesn't feel like that right now. The friend's such a good person. Why do I want to see him again? Ew. The dick must have been real good then, I, I see. I don't get it though, because he goes down on these girls for like two seconds and now like they're in love. Like, what the hell? It's stupid, I know. Okay. Well, if he's not at home, where do you think he is? And she's encouraging this behavior. Her friends are just as bad, Shadi. It's opening night. Your man just killed himself and you wanna fuck the guy who caught you fucking. And that's why he killed himself, you wanna fuck him again. This girl is crazy. I think you come. I came. Hmm. <laughs> really cool. Can't wait to see the photos. Yeah, you're gonna see yourself in your naked glory without your permission. My partner in crime on this. The love of my life, Juliet Nobatore. I really want to go home. It seems only right that she should be up here with me. Everyone, Julia. She's still alive. I knew it. <laughs> shameless. Absolutely shameless. He doesn't even care. Hi. <laughs> This new exhibition tells a modern fable. It's a tragic tale of a sweet young woman named Pippa. Oh, girl. <laughs> Did they tag team? Pippa lives in the apartment we own across the way from our studio. When she and her boyfriend, Thomas, first moved in together, the future was bright. Things were downright peachy. <gasps> then, they got a little distracted by the strangers across the way. Cared more about what was going on in other people's lives than they did their own. Not them calling them out. The whole time that they were watching us. No, we were watching them. Ooh, twist. This is so fucking obvious this is going to happen. Pippa! Pippa! Yeah, this movie is a mess. <laughs> and that was literally like on the first day. They've got a picture of them on the first day. How how did they take a picture of them? <laughs> okay, we've got a half an hour left, so like what now? And he's still cheating on his wife. This is why you mind your business. Can't say I feel sorry for you, sis. Yep, those are my boobs. This is the place. You should at least sue, sis. <laughs> All the birds have died. But Julia, your man still ain't shit. This is the image release form they signed. It's the last page of their lease. Plain and simple. Now, do I know if they actually read it? No. 
But that's not my responsibility. What? So, she was set up, they were set up from the very beginning? Okay, yeah, this movie is absolutely a mess. Do you have anything actually interesting to ask us? Why is it getting angry now? She's still watching them, girl. You ain't learned your lesson. Oh, your favorite. Scassery. Scassari. Who sent it? They're not even checking their bottles after they did someone dirty. The Tate. Oh, that's great. It could be poison. Don't you ever feel guilty? No. And now they're making her the evil one. This writer is trash. Very trash. Girl, I'm really over this film. They staged his suicide. What is she doing? She's fucking lost it. What do you think you know, Pippa? What is she gonna do now? We just wanna talk to you! And why would she wanna talk to you, Shadi? going on, Pippa? I believed every moment. Even though none of it was real. But when Thomas died, it didn't feel true, but he's still gone. Well, who went to the trouble of hanging him up? Yeah, that didn't make sense. It's what? It's not adding up. He would have never done that. And I don't know for sure, but I think you drugged him. And then you made it look like he did it himself. This is so stupid. Real or fake? Stupid. You manipulated me. You seduced me. You exposed me. Girl, he did do that, yes. But girl, you were also stupid. I have nothing left. So I just need to know this one last thing and then you'll never see me again. How could you do this? We didn't. I mean, these are professional criminals. Why would they admit to it? Oh, wait. What am I even doing? But you're too far down the road. You too. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> She's clearly been poisoned. Look at me! Take one final look. Because it's the last thing you're ever going to see. I mean, they're in your optician's building. Surely they're going to know it's you, girl. You could have done this somewhere else. She's covering her track. Check ces deux-là, qu'est-ce qu'ils font? Où ça? Ben, juste là, chérie. Il faut vraiment que je me fasse examiner les yeux. Mène-toi dans tes affaires. Finally. <laughs> She blinded them. Well, that was a very shitty movie. I feel like it almost... I feel like it was getting somewhere almost to the point where it was bad but entertaining but the twists just kept getting more and more ridiculous to be honest and then the ending was shit as well. I'm not really sure how it got commissioned to be honest but you know it's testament of when there's a will when there's a way you can get somewhere but yeah won't be watching that again <laughs> but i'd be interested to hear from you guys did you like the film did you not <laughs> as 
always let me know what you thought about my commentary subscribe if you haven't yet and if you have don't forget to put my notification bell on so you know when my next video is dropping i'm also trying to get to 3.8k subscribers i'm almost there and i'd appreciate it if you help me reach that goal and thank you to everybody who has subscribed to my channel so far till next time guys bye